Ayo, Chixo here. Today we're going to show you guys how to beat the original demon in the hell difficulty with the most well-known team. So while you're watching this right now, we are probably streaming live on Twitch in order to do a lot of demons. So um, if you have some demons you want to give me, I will gladly take them off. Of course, if you do need some help. So this is going to be the team on the one side. On the other side, we're going to replace the Arthur with the giant diane because basically the giant diane she's going to stance and she's going to tank a lot of damage because the demon actually does hit quite hard so meliodas is on an attack crit damage build um gotha hp and diane if you have attack attack might be a little bit better and we're going to use um attack food so i have dylan's account on my phone because basically we are raid partners and i told him okay you know i kind of can't trade today but if you borrow me your account we still kind of can trade if i just use your account for the video and um, yeah that's why i have his account this time so um basically in the first turn what we're going to do is we're going to um stall a little bit because it's w pretty stupid to rank up in the first turn if you do have the rank up also another thing as well is you should have different positionings of your units because um if you have the same positionings the first card is going to be the same and now this way um i actually do have the rank up immediately so we're just going to definitely taunt in the first turn that's very important and um here we are going to just burn some cards and i would say we are just going to move here and then we are good to go and um let's just see what is going to happen next so basically now if we want to okay if we want to we could rank up right away but i personally think it is actually smarter if we're going to stall a little bit because number one is um first of all you want to dump away the bad cards so that you actually have good cards and also if your diane can stack more debuffs uh, not debuffs if your diane can stack more damage then she will actually hit a little bit harder so now what we're going to do is um we're just going to stall one more turn so i can burn this here i can burn this here i would say we can probably burn this away as well um here we want to keep this card i would say we are going to actually maybe um just burning this card and moving once with the diane won't be that bad and next round we're going to buff so we have three turns when we have to rank up because we have to actually have the immunity because the problem is if we don't have the immunity he's actually going to put a debuff onto us and then the run is pretty much over um i mean it's not really over but then we can't really use any cards anymore and um then the ragnarok backline isn't that good anymore for example instead of that you can also use the um red list the red sr list which can heal because she will be super helpful in actually um just giving us some tankiness because here as you can see we did take a lot of damage but now um we took also a lot of damage um or enough damage in order to oh damn we have a lot of rank ups on this side so we're just going to have the golden rank up here um i would say we're going to rank up again uh, i mean the golden buff and now we're just going to kill him off if we can i'm not 100 percent sure this and this should be able to finish it off and then we're going to burn this as well i'm not 100 sure if this is going to be enough or not um i really hope this is going to be enough but even if it's not enough it doesn't really matter because the golden buff of arthur it is a uh, um giving us immunity as well so even if he does put us the debuffs on it doesn't it doesn't harm us that much but we should be able to kill us okay very very nice so um first phase very very easy clear and i would say we're going to show you guys two different runs just to show you guys the differences um in the run so that might be helpful to see okay maybe more mistakes or if if something i um got into my mind so number one here is when we are in the second phase we have to use a ranged card to deal i think 100k damage in order to break this so that other cards can damage as well and um the best way is having a diane card so what we're going to do is for now we do this or also the arthur wood works as well so here i will just show you guys with the arthur wood instead we do this we do this i would say um on this side i will just do this single target and this maybe we even kill immediately because um i actually have a lot of good cards so who knows maybe i can actually kill this here right now so it would be like a is it a six turner or five turner i'm not sure right now but here as you can see yeah this is the this is the fourth turn right so it's a five turner i think okay we actually deal way too much damage i'm not sure um the problem is i think he gets evasion here or he doesn't okay it's oh my god 
Oh my god, this is so unlucky, guys. So when he hits a specific damage mark, he's going to get an evasion, which is going to be only gun if he lies it enough. So um, if I wouldn't have used that um, Arthur card, we would have actually killed him and um, would have been probably, I'm not 100% sure, probably a five turner so very very unfortunate but still it doesn't really matter because as long we have a diane Torn, we are good to go and now we are going to try to finish him off so definitely we need to try to break the damage mark um that would be the best so i would say we're going to do this we are going to use the golden here on this side um we can even just use the rank up won't be that bad um and here we are going to burn some cards and getting the melee ult is very good oh, on the left side i should have gotten the melee ult as well so um definitely it is much harder to play um on two accounts because then you have to pay attention on both accounts so um misplay can happen and here as you can see bam very very easy clear and now we're just going to be in the last phase the only unfortunate thing is right now we don't have an arthur buff at all but luckily instead of the arthur buff we do have the golden rank up which is very very lucky because that will make our um melee hit much much harder so we're going to just um rank up like this then we can here have double um single target here we can just single target ult and i guess maybe this does more damage maybe i should have used the single target of diane first but yeah um all in all this demon is very very easy um it's just a little bit annoying that you should stall um so that your diane hits a little bit harder and yeah also of course stalling in order to get more cards so also another thing is if you don't get the golden arthur buff that would be a problem because if you don't get the golden arthur buff then once again you can get debuffed and then your run is pretty much over and yeah i would say one more run and then we call it a day so okay guys um we got another perfect uh, starting basically again so what we're going to do is as usual for now we're just going to burn a lot of cards all the bad cards um i would say just merging here won't be that bad here we're going to do the same thing we're going to um just merge the um buff on the arthur so that it basically gives him more ult just because you guys have seen this ult is pretty nice to have um in the second phase but yeah so let's see if we can or if we have good cards if we don't have good cards i would say we're going to stall one more turn because um the thing is it's probably better if we're going to move this away uh burning this so that we just have more um golden single targets even though we could rank up now but i think uh just taking a little bit more damage onto our um diane is a pretty good uh, thing to do also we don't have another taunt right now so what we're going to do is we do this we're going to move this away we can burn this aoe and um here we can just i would say working on the melee ult won't be that bad and move again and then doing this so um on the other hand i actually have another buff of arthur which is very very nice also another thing is um good to have basically a communication so for example if you have something to show okay i have a rank up i don't have a rank up or um that you can actually buff or that you don't buff if you do run the arthur team you need the buff thing because yeah on the right side obviously i don't really need to tell hey i can buff because i obviously can't um the card was actually pretty terrible not gonna lie um i should have probably just rank up immediately it is what it is because we got pretty much nothing but uh, at least we got the double rank up we e actually even have another rank up um as well but yeah we're going to just buff up we're going to i would say just kill in this turn again um because that way we are going to keep the um arthur buff for longer even though we still have another arthur buff if we can even kill because i'm not even 100 percent sure if we can actually kill with this but we should be able to do enough damage in order to just kill him um it's getting really really close though okay nice it is enough very very good and um now all i'm hoping for as well is actually getting a taunt again because without a taunt it can be really annoying unless i can actually um what it's called unless i can actually just one shot then it doesn't really matter another thing as well is if i can kill here right now it would be a five turner right um we took two turns no we took three turns in the first phase this would be a fourth turn yeah it would be a five turner that would be really 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 nice um unfortunately we don't have the arthur ult so what we're going to do is i would say we're just going to um attack with this okay um maybe attacking with this again so on the other side we're going to do this this and this i hope it's gonna be enough 
um, or I hope it's not going to basically proc the passive so that we can actually kill. So maybe I should have used the um, Arthur cut first or actually, oh my God, I'm not sure right now because the one star might do too much damage. So, okay, no, we are totally fine. We can actually probably make it a five turner, which is very, very nice. So as you can see, we finished without any issues this time and we still have the Arthur buff activated. So we don't need to use an Arthur buff. We also have the Arthur ult which is going to be super helpful um only unfortunate thing is on the left side uh oh we do have the melee ult as well perfect so we're just going to use both melee ults because why not we're going to use the arthur ult we're going to use this golden single target this single target and also this aoe and um then it's a five turner of the newest um cri uh not crimson demon original demon the only thing is probably that it would be a little bit better um if we would just rank up in the second turn then it could be a um what it's called it could be a four turner but yeah maybe we should do one more run and try if we can actually um four turn it and uh, if not uh, then it is what it is i think based on the thumbnail you guys might probably know if this is a four turner or a five turner or maybe even longer who knows but yeah um let's just try it out so here obviously we're going to just um turn for now we're going to burn this i would say moving this here will be pretty good um on the other side we luckily have a rank up already so what we're going to do is i would say we're just going to burn the aoe of melee because hopefully we're going to draw more melee single targets because that basically decides if we can actually four turn it or not would be really really awesome if we can't four turn it it is what it is um because i don't think it's really important to actually have a video of hey i have um done it within four turns it's more important to actually have a video of hey this is how you beat the hell difficulty okay um the card was kind of meh at least we have a single target of melee on the left side that's really awesome um we're just going to rank up um then damn i'm not sure right now so we should just rank up definitely um we are going to rank up again we're going to buff up and now we're going to use this single target um this single target so we don't have any melee single targets anymore and i would say we actually do have to use another melee single target on the left side as well just in order to basically kill him in this turn because else um i'm pretty sure we won't be able to kill in this turn once again um the problem as well is that diane didn't take that much damage it means she doesn't do that much damage which is very very unfortunate but here as you can see okay very very easy clear kind of an overkill though but yeah we don't have any other cards so unfortunately we have to do it like this so um let's see if i can just somehow rush the ult of someone so that we can easily kill it and do it or make it a four turner so um yeah i can get the melee ult here so if i'm gonna use this single target if i'm gonna use damn i should have used this single target first that's unfortunate and then this so here in this case in this side we're going to use um if I do it like this, this and this, I have melee ult as well. So um, as long... Oh, I'm so stupid. Yeah, I totally forgot about the range thing first anyways. So now we actually miss in some damage. So I hope this is going to be still enough. I think it actually is still enough because here we're going to single target AOE again and the golden melee should be easily finish it off. Oh my God, I'm not 100% sure though. So here now we might miss the... Oh my God, yes. It is actually a freaking four turner. Very, very awesome, guys. Um, so, yeah, basically what we're going to do now is luckily we have both melee ults and the melee ults, they pretty much guarantees us the rest already. So um, I will just use one or no, those two single targets first in order to maximize the stacks. Um, here, one single target, then this and then this. And then it's pretty much GG. So, yeah. Let me know in the comment section if this was helpful. Let me know in the comment section if you guys have other ideas for different teams because that would be definitely interesting as well. Because, um, yeah, basically, as I said earlier, relying on um, getting the rank up in order to get the golden um, Arthur buff in time, that is kind of annoying. But yeah, so basically, usually it is better to actually stall in order to take more damage and also draw more good cards. And yeah, that's basically it, guys. Uh, that's basically it for the video. Once again, we are streaming live on Twitch, so definitely make sure to check it out and eventually give me your demons because I need them, guys. Okay, thank you so much for tuning in and peace out for now.